and as a high school student, uh, Celia was a leader. She was president of the senior class. She was, uh, uh, you know, a gifted athlete. But we always kind of teased her because she wouldn't jump. She wouldn't put forth. She never would put forth quite a hundred percent. She put forth just enough. You know, it's kind of like she was saving herself for things later on. Uh, when she was in high school, I taught her chemistry, and. Uh, she would fall asleep during my class. I had her last period of the day. And she was tired and all the time she'd been practicing that night. And I would fuss at her about it. She'd just kind of grin at me. And she'd say, oh, I'm still doing okay. I'm still pat Yeah, you're doing all right. And she made good grades. But I told her, you know, you're going to flunk out when you go to college. And she said, oh, no, I'm going to be on the dean's list. No, you're not. And she bet me that she would be on the dean's list and said that if she was, I'd have to treat her to dinner. And I said, sure. You know, not going to happen. She came back four years later. Uh, she was on the dean's list at UA Fayetteville and played uh, basketball the whole time she was up there, which is amazing, scholar and athlete and starter, and she did learn to jump. She 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 got to 100%, and she's been 100% and 110% ever since. Uh, it's been a pleasure having her come back and talk to the students at Hall High School, because again, she wasn't, uh, she wasn't 100%. She had some rough times and just growing up and growing up in Little Rock and, uh, and deciding who you're going to be and how you're going to get there, and she's been an inspiration to the Hall High students when she speaks to them about her experiences and about the value of education. I mean, she, she lives it. She's grown into a, 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 a phenomenal young woman and it, uh, it, it tickles me to, uh, you know, been a, been a part of the process. I don't, I don't claim anything other than I bought her a dinner after she got her uh, got on the dean's list for college graduation. Right now we've got another dinner for when she finishes up her doctorate. Uh, so I'm looking forward to that. She says 2013. So we'll have another dinner date.